Good Patriot Magnets, good morning. How are we today? I'm still on the Rochdale Canal. Heading up to a new place now, not been before. See what Rochdale relics we can find. A nice little bridge there. It's near some businesses, but it's a nice little cut through for, uh, for people that want to be naughty, if you know what I mean. So I'll try and find out what's going on. Just wanted to make a, a quick statement that um, I was approached yesterday by a couple of people asking me about the news article that I've been in recently to do with recovering a safe and giving the belongings back to people. If you've not heard of the articles, I'll put a link in the description. Or what I'll do is I'll put a couple of pictures on and try and put some links on for the articles. Anyway, um, I was asked why I gave the items back and did I get a reward, etc. Well, I don't need to explain to anybody why I gave it back. People that know me know the reason why. I was brought up well, respectful. It's not my property and it had someone's ID in. And at one point, uh, the first safe I pulled out I did contact the police and uh, they wasn't helpful. So the second time, the ones with the items in, um, I did it myself. Took it upon myself to find out whose property it is and do the right thing. I don't want no reward for anything. And uh, the fact that it's made into our local news, plus to ITV, plus to Granada News, it's quite astounding. And uh, I'm quite humble in the fact that, you know, it is, it is nice. And it is nice for the person to get the items back. But this is my hobby. I don't do it for, see what I can get out of it, see how much money I can make. Just do the right thing and enjoy myself. And people that know me know what I'm going to say. Treat yourself. It's all what you got to do. And another word of advice is, pick your crap up. Don't be leaving it around, waiting for everyone else to pick it up. It's not on. It's not cool. It's not big. It's not clever. Anyway, onwards. We're going to this new part now. And uh, I'm not going to be doing much filming there because it is a bit sketchy. And I don't want to leave my recording equipment knocking around. So, I'll take some few photos, see what we can do in a bit. Right, I'm here in the spot where I'm going to fish. Um, it doesn't look like anybody's been here. It's quite a big stretch, it's right near the motorway. And in the back there, on the little ramp coming down, looks like someone's poured a load of filtration for uh, when they have a grow, if people know what that means. Yeah, so it might be a bit of a nice little hot spot for a dumping ground. Like I said, I'm not going to do too much recording yet. Uh, check the area out, it is sketchy and uh, I don't want to bring my mag wagon down here in case someone starts trying to get a bit sporty and uh, we're not having that so we're just going to crack on with what we've got to do in this little stretch here possibly going to move down because there's a bridge but we'll see where we end up and hopefully we'll get some good finds okay so we're back uh, let's start with this, two metal bars belt first belt I found washer some nice bottle caps don't think I've got them too and on here yeah this little piece of glass I think it's got snaps written on it anyway the funny thing is what it says inside giraffes can lick their own eyes mint right this is for fishing rod when it started coming out like that out of the water i think hey up we've got a bit of a rifle here but no it's a little chunk of metal a bolt and we've got uh, five pennies and that is a two p this one here is one of them air canisters but i've never seen one we're writing on uh, interesting, it's quite bigger than the other ones as well. Nail, 
and a piece of metal bar. Um, right, this here, when I was walking home all packed up, this was floating on the surface of the canal. And as you can see, got something inside it. Well, that for a find, and it says Beaver Brooks Jewels. It says nine carat gold there, but obviously that's silverish. So I don't know. I don't know. Could be just be replaced, but finds a find, isn't it? I'll put some other pictures on of the other ones that I've found because I've given such scrap man now. Okay. safe stolen more than a decade ago has been reunited with its owner thanks to a magnet fisherman wonders will never cease that's <laughs> itv.com slash granada i'm gonna eat